We are pushing the pot pie to a higher level. Our chef has a pot pie filled with seafood and is rich in taste. Let's head into the kitchens of Scott Community College where Chef Brad Scott makes a pot pie you will not soon forget. I'm Chef Brad Scott from the kitchens of Scott Community College and this is not your grandma's pie. How about some lobster? How about some crab? How about some shrimp? All in a fluffy pastry. Let's get started. I've got some shrimp, lump crab, lobster, some corn, some maripois, which is uh, carrots, onion, and celery, a little flour, some mozzarella cheese, and some puff pastry. I'm going to add about three tablespoons of chef butter to a hot pan. I'm going to dice a little garlic, a little pop first. Just a rough cut right to the stove. We're going to dice up our shrimp in about dime-sized pieces. We're going to add our mirepoix and our corn. We want to get these nice and soft. Quick stir. Little salt and pepper, and we're going to chop our lobster. Again, one pan. We're going to add about three tablespoons of flour and get our roux going. All we want is a nice little paste. We're going to add our seafood. And about a cup and a half of heavy cream. I told you this wasn't grandma's. We're going to let this cook down to a lazy bubble and we're going to add our mozzarella. About a half a cup. Remember the broadcast. We're going to turn our heat off and let it tighten up a little bit. Doesn't that look good? Take about a three-quarter sheet of puff pastry. I'm going to spray my casserole dish Drop my puff pastry right over the top. You should take it out of the freezer about 15 minutes before you want to uh, make this dish. So it's nice and pliable. And we're ready to fill. Got to have plenty of lobster in there. We're going to fold the edges up, pinch them closed. And we're ready for the oven. This goes in about a 375 oven for about 25 minutes. You know, this is really a rich dish that could easily serve two. And it would go great with a piece of filet. I think we're about ready. Let's see. Oh, that's beautiful. Nice and golden brown and cheesy. Full of vegetables, full of seafood. Definitely not your grandma's pot pie. Enjoy. Thanks, Chef. We didn't count the calories, but we do know you'll want to save that pot pie for a special meal with your family and friends.